deadly mix. Did the chemicals used to break up that oil in the Gulf do more harm than good? Little is known about the effect of these chemicals applied in such great amounts. The EPA insists dispersants are biodegradable, but many locals worry their community could become another love canal. I just don't know that anyone can say today whether dispersants was a good choice or a bad choice. It may have been the lesser of evils. Uh, only time will tell did the dispersants actually have a long-term effect on uh, our ecology and environment or not. We have some unique facilities that enable us to simulate a, a real oceanic conditions in a very controlled laboratory setup. This information then will go into large-scale uh, field models that actually try to predict the fate of oil. Essentially, I built the wave tank from scratch. It's a 20 feet long wave tank and it can generate from non-breaking waves to very violent uh, breaking waves. It's amazing. The Deepwater Horizon event was the first oil spill in which they actually went down with a submarine and injected dispersant into the oil that was coming out of the earth. When you have an oil well blow out on the bottom of the ocean, you almost have this, this cloud or this uh, smokestack of, of oil that rises from the bottom. And as it rises, it gets swept by the current. And so you have these droplets that are rising in the current. And so I built a towing tank to try to simulate that process. And so we're looking at how that dispersant breaks the oil up into very small droplets, and then looking at how those droplets rise much more slowly, um, and how that interaction changes the structure of the plume. And that ultimately affects where the oil goes. What happens to, uh, after an oil spill? How fast the oil disperses? How much of the oil is going to end up in the marshes? How much of the oil will settle to the bottom? We need to answer those questions. Otherwise, we don't really have tools to predict and then we don't really know what kind of tools do we need to develop to mitigate the adverse effect of oil.